reports uh, from some platforms that suggest that what is known as the Delta variant of COVID-19 has been found in Ghanaian communities, or it's in Ghana. In fact, the story says that one, it is in Ghana, and that two, the vaccines that um, we have currently approved and are working with Astra and Sputnik are not effective in dealing with them. And the story is attributed to uh, one very respected uh, scientist, uh, Professor Awandari. Um, the Ghana Health Service has issued a response to that. And I want to crave your indulgence that please make some time and have your networks publish the truth. Very often, we in the media, we are guilty of this. When we say something that is not true and it turns out to be untrue, we quickly hide it and move to the next story. But it is important that we correct these untruths for the general public to understand. This job that we do, we do it in the interest of the public. So I beg of you to make some time and publish this uh, rejoinder from the Ghana Health Service so that the public is informed. And the two important parts of it, with your indulgence, let me just highlight. The Ghana Health Service informs the general public that all passengers who test positive at the Kotoka International Airport are put under mandatory isolation. Mandatory is not whether you like it or not. Mandatory isolation. All positive samples are then sent for further testing, what we call the genomic sequencing, to identify the particular variant. The variants sequenced from samples of positive cases at the airport do not necessarily end up in the Ghanaian community. So if you hear that some positive samples after genomic sequencing prove to be from the Delta variant, it doesn't mean it is in the community. It is because the surveillance system was able to arrest it at the airport into mandatory uh, quarantine. So it does not necessarily mean that it has ended up in the Ghanaian community. Um, as of now, 22nd of June 2021, the country has detected six Delta variants of SARS-CoV-2 from all the samples that were taken between April and June at the ports of entry and no Delta variant has been detected from samples taken from within the community. And colleagues, it's important that we get this um, out to the understanding of the Ghanaian community. Now, another part I want to read. On the issue of vaccines, reports that the Sputnik V and Astra vaccines are not effective against the Delta strain of SARS-CoV-2 are untrue. And all the data from the Public Health England that shows the uh, percentage levels of efficacy have been provided in the statement. <laughs>